All right, good day, my friends. How's things going out there in YouTube land with you guys? For me, it's going back to 2022 springtime. And, well, the big crash after my e-bike, electric bike ride around the downtown Vancouver. So today, check out something different. And at the end of this video, we'll get to the ugliness of my crash where I broke off three of my teeth. So, check out today's video. Gotta find a spot to get, grab a coffee. <laughs> a good coffee. Yeah, it's okay, buddy. Da -da -da. Where is she going? Even though you see me weaving through cars, I'm doing it at a slow speed and being careful. Oh, we're going. We don't want to go waterfront around. Okay. I made the decision to not ride on the sidewalks because I didn't want to hurt any people or injure anybody. So off we go off of the sidewalk. Again, playing it safe, waiting behind the bus and not passing the bus either. Okay, I shouldn't have went back on this sidewalk. Uh, too many people. Come on, dumbass. Now, our plan was to go down the waterfront here, but there was police cars everywhere. All the roads were blocked off down here. More police and more blockages. What the hell's going on? <laughs> what, what happened? Can we go this way? No. Now, what I didn't realize at the time was Canadian's Prime Minister and leader, Justin Trudeau, was in town. So there was security and road blockages everywhere. 
I guess so. Maybe down around. Bad problem is So I'm feeling a little uncomfortable with all the cars behind me in traffic, so I'm just gonna pull over here and wait for them to go by. Everybody's waiting. Here and there. Yeah. There's a. I think the hotel or something blocked off. Yeah. Now some of these trails. So some of these sidewalks are designated bike only. That's the one that I'm on right now. Idea. Oh, look at the water, please. Even the water police are there, huh? blocked up uh. Uh. okay how's this ready look at that <laughs> the mad biker wiped out uh, I think my partner in crime uh, stopped and I think I tried to go around her and I came off the bike and bit the cement. <laughs> if it was dirt it would have been a little bit better but yeah jaw is swollen up. I don't know if it's broken or not but <laughs> maybe fractured. Fractured my head. Uh, so maybe a full face helmet is a better idea. So anyways good times. What Chuck say? Good times.
<laughs> man, Chuck is a plum fool, man. Yeah, it hurts. Tomorrow is gonna be uh, worse. So I limped the bike home and didn't damage too much. A little bit of paint scuffing. That's what we did. And I bent the handlebars. So the wheels are straight right now, but the handlebars are, look at, see? So the handlebars are crooked. So my body took took that and bent it and I'm having, so I'm gonna try and straighten it out a little bit there. And oh yeah, my jacket. I scratched the shit out of my jacket. Look at a few holes in the jacket. So, oh yeah, good times. And look at my riding gloves. Holy shit. I ripped, ripped the shit out of my driving gloves when I landed on the pavement. And I guess, <laughs> yeah, I kind of woke up like a little bit groggy. So I almost got knocked out. And you know, I was spitting out cement and I broke off a chunk of my tooth. I spit out a piece of my tooth or a couple little shards. So yeah, ugly scene boys. Oh, is that? No, nothing. Just that. Two hours later. Okay, check this out. Wow, a lot of fluid coming out. I guess that's a good thing I'm not all dried up, right? Yeah, it feels, uh, I can feel it slightly. <laughs> so that was our big bike crash of 2022 uh yeah like i said i broke off a couple of teeth there <laughs> not a good thing but hey you know what like the saying is shit happens my friends uh, i got some interesting videos coming up so stay tuned if you've made it this far in the video i say thank you very much We'll see what the results were afterwards, a couple days after the big crash and beyond. So cheers until next video. Stay awesome, my friends.